Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Dear viewers, apna the shabai ke shagotam, our busy piping and welding course class. Hai. So welcome to all of you in basic piping and welding course. I give this course name is uh, piping, basic of piping and welding. So in this uh, lecture, I will uh, try to explain you some uh, basic of uh, piping. So actually this uh, lecture uh, design and prepared by myself my name is uh, Noor Muhammad and uh, you are watching from watch and learn facebook page and youtube channel Noor Muhammad So today we are going to be start a lecture for general briefing about piping types of pipe So previously I have been uploaded in my youtube channel and facebook page watch and learn uh, lecture 1, 2, 3. If you miss out lecture 1, 2 and 3, you can visit my uh, Facebook page and YouTube channel to watch the lecture 1, 2, 3. So, uh, today we are uh, going to be start lecture 4. So, let's see what we have in uh, lecture 4. So, before we start lecture 4, I want to tell you uh, some things. This lecture also I designed uh, two part actually. First part I will uh, uh, try to explain you uh, something about the types of pipe then second part I make some questions for you so uh, if you listen this uh, lecture is carefully then you will able to understand and you will able to answer the question so I am going to ask you to ask the question to ask you to ask the question to ask the question to ask the question basically our client we have an interview face for you common and general question so we can see this lecture we can see this lecture we can see this question and answer this question so okay let's see what have been uh, lecture for so types of pipe so in this lecture I try to share with you some information about types of pipe if you are uh, considered as a metal then we can say metallic pipe and non metallic pipe अपने जी मेटल कंसीडर करें तो हम डा बोलते हैं बनी मेटलिक पाइप एंड नॉट मेटलिक पाइप। देन स्टैंडर्ड मेटल पाइप। जो नी इफ यू सी द स्टैंडर्ड मेटल पाइप देन वी सी द। देर आर टू डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड मेटल पाइप। ऑन इस वेल्डेड पाइप, सीम पाइप, ऑन इस सीमलेस पाइप। सो पाइप बेसिकली ह so actually welded pipe is first cold form into a cylindrical shape and then welded longitudinally then you can see from these uh, photos this uh, pipe is uh, longitudinally is welded that means this pipe uh, firstly was the same as the plate then this is the form make the cylindrical shape then welded is uh, longitudinally actually this uh, welding uh, the done by the SAW process or ERW so for this welding process I will discuss another uh, lecture you can see the beside one more uh, photos so you see inside the pipe is welded so this type of pipe is a uh, welded pipe then we see the what is the seamless pipe so seamless pipe is formed by forcing molten metal through a round die with a plug in the center to form a long tube of continuous metal which is then cut into appropriate lane there is no any oil joint so welded pipe, uh, seamless pipe, मुलतो एक टा shaper मोती दिए round round रेडी shaper मोती दिए लम्बा pipe तो इडिकरा है तार पर एक टा के शुभिता मुन्नु जनो का lane तुन्नु जे काटा है and in between pipe आ don't have any welding joint so you can see from photos they are don't have any welding joint so uh, metallic pipe uh, I will uh, try to share with you some uh, information here regarding the metallic pipe so hotipar is commonly used in uh, oil and gas shipping industries and uh, power plant or other uh, area so commonly used uh, some uh, pipe uh, metallic pipe i will uh, show you in this uh, lecture so first i start from a uh, carbon steel pipe what is the where is the short form is the cs so commonly used grade stm a106 grade b stm a53 grade b and apx52 so you can see from our photos in pipe uh, body the writing have a stm 106 a 53 grade b then the next photos you can see here writing api 5l psl x52 
so if you see this type of writing in the body of pipe then you will be able to understand this is the carbon steel pipe so then we see the number two is the stainless steel pipe so stainless steel commonly use stm a 312 tp 306l and stm 312 tp 316l so this is i actually uh, highlight here only the commonly used pipe if you visit the stm then you can see so many grade is uh, available so typically i issue some uh, example is here only for your understanding so you see the photo same as the stm uh, a 312 uh, pipe 304l so same as the before photos the carbon steel this is the same so if you see this type of marking you will be able to understand this is the stainless steel pipe then beside photos also same uh, then you go uh, for the next the duplex stainless steel pipe short form is uh, DSS so you see the DSS commonly use STM A790 2205 uh, UNS S31803 so you see the photos uh, they are writing have S31803 if you see that this type of writing and STM789 so you will able to understand this is the DSS pipe so number four is the super duplex stainless steel pipe so short form is SDSS so commonly use STM A789 then 2507 UNS S32750 UNS S32760 etc so you can see the photos is the same as uh, before the writing have UNS three S three two seven six zero. So metallic pipe, another pipe is the copper nickel. <coughs> we are uh, commonly used in the our uh, industries and very uh, large large uh, number of pipe is used for the copper nickel. So commonly used uh, this one actually follow the specification E E M U A Engineering Equipment and Material Users Association UK. So, great. Uh, normally, we use commonly copper nickel C U N I UNS C seven zero six hundred, UNS C seven zero sixty X, C U N I ten F E one So, this is the uh, normal uh, commonly used grade. Uh, you can grade, can get the so many uh, grade if you visit the E E M U A uh, standard or specification. Then we see the this pipe photos. You can see the here writing uh, C seven zero six zero X. So this is the actually uh, for the copper nickel identification. So you can uh, check here and you can identify this is the copper nickel pipe. And you can see the specification E E M U A. So this these things uh, where you get you, you will be able to understand this is the copper nickel pipe. <coughs> then uh, we go to the titanium the another uh, metallic pipe is the titanium pipe so titanium commonly use stmb861 stmb862 grade 12 grade 5 etc so this is the typical uh, example only so you can get so many uh, uh, grades in stm so these photos also i attach for you for you to uh, easy to understand you see the stmb861 titanium grade 12 so this is the typical uh, example only then uh, next we come to the non-metallic pipe so for non-metallic pipe I will uh, show you some uh, photos and the, what is the non-metallic pipe we use so for non-metallic pipe I uh, actually prepare very simple if uh, you people if all people are requested me to prepare the non-metallic pipe details then I will prepare one more lecture for only for non-metallic pipe so let's see what have the in uh, non-metallic piping so commonly used in oil and gas and shipping industries uh, GRE so you all know whoever is the this uh, sector we all people are uh, very familiar with this what GRE glass reinforced epoxy pipe so you see uh, how look like is this pipe so you see the photos this is the look like is the GRE and GRE pipe is look like the, uh, this type and so many the, you see the hair is the color is black but it can be the different color but uh, so this is the look the, the number two you can see the HDPE high density polyethylene so this is the look like this so this type of pipe you when you see the I, 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 wherever I see this type of pipe you can see this type of uh, marking and this type of uh, material actually so this is the HDPE pipe 
maybe it can be the, the different uh, marking also but the number three you can see the what is GRP so glass fiber reinforced plastic pipe so look like uh, you see the photos this also look like the GRE but this is the GRP pipe glass fiber reinforced plastic the number four you can see the PPC pipe polyvinyl chloride so for this word PPC we are very familiar because we are uh, use this pipe in our house also so see the how it look like this pipe so this is the PPC pipe then you go to the CPBC pipe chlorinated polyvinyl chloride so this look like a uh, same the PPC pipe CPBC so uh, number uh, now you have the next section in this section uh, we arrange uh, we prepare some question and answer section so this section I will uh, give you some questions the previous the lecture 2 and lecture 3 also I give you some questions but still I never prepare for you any answer section so I hope after this section after these three section I will prepare on lecture for the answer section so lecture 1 2 3 4 so I will try to give the answer section so let's see what uh, questions are waiting for us in this section the what is the meaning of uh, GRE I will detail in my lecture so you can answer your questions so what is the SS I will detail in lecture what is the actually meaning of DSS then HGPE then you can see the GRP PBC then uh, CPBC and CUNI so this is the all the short form you need to uh, answer the what is the full meaning of the, these things then let's see what is the question is the uh, next one thing for us then uh, number nine question is commonly used as TMB861 grade 2 for actually for which uh, pipe carbon steel pipe stainless steel pipe or titanium pipe the number 10 uh, commonly used STMA 106 grade B, STMA 53 grade B, API X52 actually for which uh, type of uh, metal metallic pipe so duplex stainless steel pipe super duplex stainless steel pipe and carbon steel uh, pipe so you should be answered uh, these things uh, if you listen my lecture carefully then you will be able to understand my uh, questions and you will be able to answer the number 11 STM790-2205 UNS S31803 used for actually which uh, metallic pipe copper nickel pipe then titanium pipe then the duplex stainless steel pipe then question 12 this lecture uh, I will know I want to ask you again that this lecture is helpful if helpful you must uh, share with your uh, friends then answer you yes or no so this was the actually uh, question answer section so this uh, lecture you are watching from watch and learn uh, facebook page if you think this lecture really is helpful then you can share with uh, your friends we want to learn together so please like and follow my facebook page if you think it would be helpful please in uh, press in like give you react must give your valuable feedback in comments and share with your friends if you are still uh, not subscribe my youtube channel then you can visit my youtube channel youtube channel name is Nur Muhammad then you can subscribe uh, my channel to get the next video so types of pipe regarding these uh, types of pipe any questions you can ask me in uh, comments box I will try, try to reply you and I want to tell you if any wrong information in this uh, lecture you can uh, notify me so I will try to uh, make correction myself so thanks to all uh, for watching uh, this video see you soon in uh, next uh, lecture till now uh, till, uh, till to next lecture I hope uh, you will be okay so stay safe see you soon inshallah assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh